back to the video. So today is Monday and we're back at Liufu Theme Park Village. But today's a little bit different because today is our day off. So we get to come to Theme Park as visitors and not as staff. So we get to actually enjoy the theme park, get to go on some rides, eat the food, um, see the sights, take some photos and do all the fun things that you do at a theme park other than work. So we are so keen for today. We've been excited for this for days and that's an absolute understatement. We were so keen. We had a pizza party last night to celebrate our day off and today we get to spend the whole day at the theme park um, and the water park because there's a water park here as well. So super keen to discover everything that there is to do here at Liu Theme Park and we will keep you updated on what we do for the rest of our day. We decided to start off our big day of exploration at the South Pacific section where we decided to just go crazy and try out all the rides. So some kid vomited on the pirate ship ride. <laughs> And so what they do is they get the water from the swamp below us in a bucket and then they it's just renew throw it Goes in on a the pirate ship to clean it. So to clean the ride, the vomit off the ride, they use the swamp water and then the swamp water runs off the pirate ship and back into the water with the vomit in it. And then, then the vomit feeds the fish which then feed the water, then the water, <laughs> so it's a circle. <laughs> Health and safety here in Taiwan is a whole other level. <laughs> but we still went on the ride anyway after being instructed to sit on the opposite side of the ride to where the kid had just thrown up. and splash and that usually happens while we're performing so we're gonna go see what it's like to be on one of those rides right next to our performance stage are you ready Lassie? So basically you jump in these seats, it goes all the way to the top of the tower and then it just drops to the ground. Um, for those who don't know, I have a really bad fear of heights. And I'm actually shaking. <laughs> I'm so scared to go on this ride, but the girls are making me go because they're good friends like that. So let's hope that I survive this without sobbing or crying or jumping out of my seat. Well, wish me luck. <laughs> so there are four sides to this ride, and currently um, three of the four signs had a uh, closed for maintenance sign off it, and the guy just comes along, takes off the maintenance sign on the side and just opens up the seats. I don't know how safe that is. I don't think we should be going on this ride, guys. I don't think it's safe. A few moments later. 
12 seconds later. After thoroughly enjoying the South Pacific section, we walked on over to the Wild West area yeah! in the theme park. Oh, so we are currently at one of the Western themed restaurants in the Western section of the theme park, the Wild Wild West section, and we've just got some burgers, some fries, I got a drink, um, basically all the cups and fries and stuff in the theme park all have the theme park's mascot on it, which is the monkeys, happy and honey, and so we're just going to enjoy a bit of food before we uh, finally head off and do some more rides. We have Ari some food. Lassie are uh, already doing one of the big, big roller coasters that's just outside instead of having lunch. Uh, but we've opted to have some food first, and then I think we're going to think about heading off to the water park a bit later on. Um, yeah, probably some more rides. Next. I will update you a little bit later on. I don't know, it just makes me feel like there's something authentic. <laughs> Even the burgers here have a picture of the monkey mascot's face on them, printed onto the bread. So if you can see there, there's a monkey and this is the same, same monkey as on the burger. They're dedicated to their mascot here. We then walked around the Wild West section for a bit. Casey and Ari found some horses to sit on. Then we made our way over to the Aladdin section. So we're in the Aladdin slash Middle Eastern section now. Um, we just got some ice cream. Ice cream! That's so cool! You see no ice cream? Oh yeah! I got a fountain! <laughs> oh bless. Um, that was a lot of fun. We got Turkish um, ice cream so they do all the tricks with their sticks before giving you the ice cream. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. Eat. Boy. Boy. Okay, see you soon. Australia. Australia.
forced to go on said ride. <laughs> After a few more rides like this merry-go-round, we decided to go visit the zoo that they have here at the theme park. We have now, oh, hair is green everywhere. We have now entered the wildlife section of the park. So here at Leo Fool, they actually have a whole wildlife sanctuary slash zoo area. Um, so here they have goats, behind me they have horses, and um, throughout the zoo, section of the um, of the theme park they also have lions, tigers, lions and tigers and bears. monkeys, rhinos, flamingos and a whole bunch of other animals that I can't actually think of right now but I'm sure we will get to see at some point this afternoon so we are keen to check out all the animals that they have here at the zoo section of the park. Any? Oh it's just going to stand up. Oh, you're a meerkat. There's one from Brisbane. <laughs> oh, there. There they are. Oh. There's a meerkat. Hi, Ari. <laughs> it's a white one. So we're meant to be going on a bus tour of, of the animals but we look like we're going through the back entrance to where we get dropped off in the morning. <laughs> where are we going? Oh there's a rhino bus. There's a rhino bus. Oh here we go, here's some animals. Can you feel the love tonight? We don't agree with animals being kept in enclosures. We were just visiting as we work here at the theme park and not because we are fans of animals in captivity. They have dumplings in the shape of zoo animals here. I love it so much. Look, you have a lemur, tiger, horse, rhino, and Pikachu. Oh, no, it's a meerkat. But how adorable are these little bones? What? I didn't know we're doing Victoria's Secret model shoot. What? I was in a meerkat. Wow! Look at that guys, we're famous. So it's Keisha, me, and then Ari next to me. It's a bit blurred, but woo, we're famous and we're on all the, the billboards and stuff all around the theme park. And after all that, walking around and eating and riding rides, we decide to cool off at the Little Fort Water Park. And wasn't that just something truly special? Where are we heading to now? To the water! Bless! I just hope it's not contaminated. Ooh. We are now heading to Liofu Water Park. We're about to go for a swim, hopefully go on some slides, have a good time. So keen for this been waiting all. We've been waiting all day to go to the water park and I'm so excited to finally go for a swim! It's been so long and it's actually ridiculously hot here today so let's go to the water park! So here's the current situation. We've just found out that in order to be able to get into the pools here at the water park we need to wear swimming caps. So we are all here at the little boutique here at the water park all buying these ridiculously ugly and overpriced swimming caps just so we could go swimming. But, so yeah, we now have to spend like eight bucks Australian, 150 Taiwanese dollars to get a damn swimming cap so we can go swimming. But, I really, really want to go swimming, so I'm just gonna fork out the money and get a damn ugly swimming cap. So, we've all bought the ugly swimming caps. 
So now we're going to head over to the pool. This is really... <laughs> I was so excited to go swimming and now I'm kind of not because we have to wear these things on our heads. What did you just do it again, Jello? Ready! Yes, shorts. You can only go swimming. I need a record. But I'm saying, you see everybody here. They have I feel swings. ridiculous. You look ridiculous. So I got a swimming cap that would match oh, my swimmers because I'm super extra like that. And um, so we're all just getting changed now into our um, swimmers and our swimming caps and ready to go swimming. Now I think the best look of the day goes to Ari with her fluoro pink swimmers and her fluoro pink swimming cap. <laughs> we're these back in um, Drew Vale. Yep. Pool time. A little later. So we, ooh, a bit noisy. So we finished up at the water park and we walked down the road and made it to Liufu Resort, where our African friends are actually doing their show in about half an hour's time. So we came over to support and see their show and also visit the resort, which is attached to the theme park that we work for. And this is literally inside the resort. There is a whole zoo area. There are rhinos, there are lemurs, there are zebras, all this right outside the windows of the people staying here. This is incredible. It's so beautiful. It's just absolutely breathtaking. We're back in the lobby of Liofu Resort and we're about to watch our friends, the Africans, perform their daily show that they have here each and every day. And we're so excited to see because we haven't seen them perform yet. They've seen us perform but we haven't seen them perform so we're so excited. Enjoying your ice cream. It's so creamy, but like it's not as minty as what I thought it would be, but it's good. Come to me. So we finished watching the African show. 
It was really, really good. amazing. Holy it was joy. really good. The energy is just incredible. Yeah. But um, we're so tired right now. Sorry, I'm probably sounding like the show was not that great, but it really was. It was really amazing. But um, we had to leave because we have to go to the supermarket and do our grocery shopping because we have no more food left in the house. But um, we got some ice creams so that way we don't die of hunger on the way to the supermarket. And after that, I'm going home, going to bed. I'm so knackered. I'm sunburnt. I think I have a broken nose. Um, my swimming time, however, is over because I basically need myself in the face coming off this ride. But all good. It's been such a good day. Such a eventful, great day. we stood on the side of the road for a while and waited for a taxi to take us home. And friends, that marked the end of our day of adventure and discovery at Lilful Theme Park. Hope you enjoyed this video, remember to like and subscribe and we'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now.